the Infinity Garden, part three. Oh my days, has this got some legs or what? Now let me tell you about some stuff. I can't go into too much detail, simply down to the fact that the data protection and all this sort of stuff. But I can talk about little bits and I'm quite excited to talk to you about it. The idea is that we've taken it to a bunch of students that are suddenly in social work and social care and that kind of area of the world and got all these lovely concepts and ideas that we've created over the last, well, since last year, give or take, really. And we've taken it to these students and they are going to be the people that look at it and go, this is dreadful. Or, hey, oh my days, this is tremendous. Now, I can't talk about it too much, but I will probably be able to do a small interview with my mate, Karen. She's wonderful. I think it's really good because if this works, the Infinity Garden, we might be able to try and raise some money and put it in like a sprint van and take it around different festivals around the entirety of the UK. As long as I can get home for tea and my wife isn't upset with me. And give it to people that require forgiveness and olive branches and mental adjustment through art therapy, which is awesome. Did you know there's 2,500 individual children's homes in the UK? This could be wonderful for that. Infinity. It's just a garden! Hi! Do you want to jump in? Are you ready? It's pound for the ride, mate. <laughs> <laughs> got a business here, so run, you know what I mean? Got a quid out of that, that's mint. Cheers. And here we have, through the bricken and the bracken, it's a c-c-c-carrot. <laughs> Did you enjoy the ride? It was great, It yes. was good, wasn't it? I'm going to give all this up, Karen, and just start doing that. I think you should. I think you've got a career in that, Cheers, definitely. Cheers, mate. Yeah. I'll have a quick wander around. I'll show you what this, because the students out there can't talk about the students, because of data protection. Yes, Isn't that right? right? Health and safety, data protection. This is a pissed off post box, so if you're ever really upset, you can write a little note, and put it in the post box, and you press this, and everyone claps, which is great. Just like that. It's amazing. This is a thought removal tree. This, actually, a version of this might be a, a festival in, what's it called again? Envirolution. Envi the idea is you take a balloon, think about something bad like, <laughs> and then you attach it to the tree. I won't tell you what I was trying to think about. This is an amnesty bin. Look at my little dude in there, can you see him? Oh, he just gets to know all the things that you write and you put it in here. So if you've got something that's stuck in your mind, you're like, oh, I need to get that out of my mind. This is the place for you to put it, which is good. There's my olive tree. Call her Olive. Infinity Garden. Look ages that. There's a little silent disco over there, which is brilliant. And check this out. There's Keith being Keith, he's a rabbit. This is the slate that people drew on uh, the last time we did the Infinity Garden, which was a few days ago. And they're beautiful. Self-portraits. And on the back of them, it's part of their lives that I'd like to be replenished part of their lives that people would like new slates in if somebody wants a new hand there look at that one i wish i could go back in time to the good old days and look at the little music sign there obviously a beetle fan there because that's where music started to get rubbish after that isn't that amazing and obviously my little dudes are here he's long way around you right? Yeah? Good, he's alright now. Look after him, Keith. So we're ready to go, aren't we? We're ready. And we'll talk about all the rest of it later on. We'll, I'll pull you along in the little trolley thing again if you want. I'll pull you along because I think... Is it my turn? Yeah, it's your turn. You've got the quid anyway, haven't you? Yeah, quid. I'll just take the quid back and give it back yeah. to you. This is the way it should go. That's the way it should be. And then look at this. This is a great concept. This is called the bungee family. Now the idea with this one is you attach yourself to it and as you walk along, you carry this box and on the box it says the following. One must not open, that's number one, who was part of the three people family, until two become three. Don't share the chest secret, only one gets to see. Three become two, as one leaves the little family. One season is set free, two becomes one, 
and the cycle repeats, which is a great idea. So only one of you gets to open it and inside it is a secret message. Life is a sequence of holding on and letting go. Are you all right in there? Yeah? Let's see if you've got a smile. <laughs> so we'll put that there. So that's it, and it's brilliant. And all these students are now about to come in. That are, what are they practicing? Social care? Yeah, so they, they work yeah, in sort of health and social care. Health, social care. Education. Education. Uh, community. Community. Voluntary groups. Stuff statutory like organisations. And this is an actual university. Oh, that's amazing. Everything's amazing. Right, should we let him in? Oh, oh, we've got to put music on as well. I've made some music. It's brilliant. Right, cool. Let's do it and we'll talk about it in a bit. <laughs> do you just... I've just finished face. It's good, that. <laughs> in fact, do you want to do the thumbnail together? Yeah, OK. It's a bit weird when you watch it on the telly like this, but... One of them would be brilliant. Here you go. Pound, please. I kind of wish you could stand up on it and maybe get a megaphone. <laughs> right. Onwards! Hooray! You almost bloody killed me! <laughs> We're finished now. You had fun? It's been great. It's been good. Cheers, mate. <laughs> it's becoming a bit of a running joke that I drop my phone in every single vlog now, isn't it? <laughs> but it is true. I do genuinely drop my phone in every single vlog. <laughs> so how did that go? I thought it was uh, it was good. <laughs> what do you think of it all? Um, the first group was like 80 people. Maybe 60? 400. 400. <laughs> it's a big deal. Yeah, it's uh, got a million. <laughs> we cured a million people today. <laughs> and then the second one was like 20? 20? Yeah, 20. Right, so like 60 and 20, mm. that's 80. Yeah. That's 80 people. Yep. And we took the forgiveness tree and the East Lake Garden and all the nice things and the psychological ideas and all the rest of it. And we're not allowed to mention any students by name or anything like that, but we can talk yeah. about the gist. Yeah. I can't wait. General. What do you think? Did it, was it good or...? I, I think, I think it was, I think everyone got something out of it. Yeah? Even if they felt a bit uncomfortable about it, that they could recognise, they could make links with when they're working with people yeah. out in the community. Service user yeah. was the big word, wasn't yeah. it? So, because all these people are going to be proper bods that are helping people out, aren't they really? Yeah. And yeah. people used all of them, people used the New Slate Garden and they used the Amherst bin and they did the Silent Disco yep. and the quotes on the wall and the cards, we had yeah. some cards which were printed off from the School of Life, they were quite they were Yeah, quite with those good. questions, they, they were saying that opened up conversations. Yeah, um, and it was made like a proper people, thing, wasn't it? Was, it? Yeah, it made people think in different ways. Yeah. Um, and it did open up, yeah, open up conversations throughout. What were the negatives? Mm -hmm. Me. Today, I the, was the negative. <laughs> the room was too small. But, well, the room, you know, environment. Yeah, so can't handle that. No. We had some people that opened up to the post box and the amnesty bin and the thought removal trees and stuff like that that touched on some stuff that they weren't ready to open up to. Is that a fair way of putting that, or how would you put that? Yeah, and I suppose it's it's for recognizing for people. That there is support out there and yeah. recognising if you're working with vulnerable people that you need to know yourself before yeah. working with other people. So, so we now know that we need yeah. like a bunch of leaflets and some telephone numbers and some from the 80 people that we took this to, I think maybe two people were a bit more affected than not affected. Yeah. But the good thing was that they were able to express that. Which in the was right really good in the right setting, setting. And the right environment. And there is, we're good people, we know what we're on about. And there's support available for them. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, developing it in other, in other environments, it is about having having those leaflets and that information for people. Yeah, it's very powerful. Yeah, cool. <coughs> right. Yeah. Well, there you go. So we need to do some more. Yeah. And take over the world, and go and live like hippies in a barge. <gasps> yeah, I like the idea of a barge. Yeah, I like the idea of a barge actually. A barge that goes around the entirety of the canals of the area. Yeah. 
solving people's problems. Have you got anything else that you want to say? Um, not at this juncture. Thanks for almost killing me with a card for as well. It was worth it. A, a pound's worth it. I forgive you. Oh, thank you. Sorry, mate. <laughs> Without forgiveness Thanks, Olive. <laughs> Little Olive brand. Little Olive. <laughs> Right, okay, cool. Yeah. Well, hopefully, Marvelous. so the next steps are we're going to do it in like a, maybe a festival in Viralution yep. in, a, in May. 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 Yep. Uh, and then maybe try and make it something more yep. and use it as a Rolling Stone to take itself around the world on a barge. Yeah, on a barge, that's or, it. Or not. <laughs> on a barge, on a bicycle. On a ba oh my God, don't make me go around the world on a bicycle <laughs> dragging an olive tree around. On a barge. Do you want some forgiveness? <laughs> Cost you a quid and I'll give you a go in my car. <laughs> you really want to see that happen, don't you? <laughs> I do, I can see it happening already. <laughs> do you want to say last words? Bye. <gasps> I got a video from before you dancing. Should I just show that? Yes. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> right, see you later.